This is Artifacts of Mars, and I have never been so ashamed in my entire life of what's going on in this country. By now, pretty much everybody knows that Trump uh, confidant Roger Stone has been arrested. Now this is a political arrest. It has nothing to do with the law. Roger Stone, as far as I'm concerned, has done nothing wrong. Uh, the, he is a political prisoner. I'm going to say that again. Roger Stone is a political prisoner of these insane leftists. Now, interestingly enough, the uh, Communism News Network was there on hand to film the arrest, which means they were tipped off by, uh, or tipped off by Mueller, who needs to be arrested himself. President Trump, you must fire Robert Mueller immediately. You have to fire him. There's no choice now. I haven't got it too much into it, but President Trump, fire Mueller, pardon Stone, and be done with this. Enough is enough. As the news broke of a pre-drawn raid on Roger Stone's home Friday morning in Florida by 29 heavily armed agents and 19 vehicles, lights flashing, CNN serendipitous Leon Han, still early, uh, to film the raid, millions of us realize once and for all we are no longer living in America we knew and loved. That's true, we aren't. Well, same millions of us who have known for over two years that Mueller probe was a huge and well-orchestrated cover-up. There are now at least two books, Greg Jarrett's and Dan Bongino's, as well as well-researched investigative articles that prove this beyond doubt. Mueller was appointed by Rod Ro Rosenstein, who shall also be arrested, not to investigate tr Trump collusion with Russia. The principals all knew it was not remotely true. He was appointed to conceal and obliterate the volumes of evidence of crimes committed by Hologram Hillary, her campaign, and a group of higher-ups in the FBI, DOJ, and CIA, all of whom were involved in the scheme to prevent Trump from being elected. All of them have lied on their oath and before Congress. Mueller himself was involved in the Clinton scheme to sell 20% of U.S. uranium to Russia. So I didn't know that. Uh, people, we got a serious situation here. Uh, I don't say it again. Roger Stone is a political prisoner. This has nothing to do with the law. And we all know it. I don't know what, I don't know what the hell we can do. Other than get on your, uh, get on the phone to your congressman and demand his immediate release and the charges to be dropped. That's about that's about the most we can do. It's short of an option that I'm not going to mention here, but uh, that's about the most we can do. Get on the phone, demand Roger Stone be released, demand Mueller be arrested immediately and fired, along with Rod Rosenstein and all the uh, officers who <laughs> went to his home. All, I don't care. It says uh, 29 heavily armed agents. All of them should be fired immediately. They knew this was a political arrest. All of them need to be fired immediately, lose their pensions, and be imprisoned. All of them are corrupt. All of them are criminals. Period. Then the subject. I'm not even going to listen. Anybody say, oh, artifacts. 
What if he did this? He, he's charged. He got what? Blah, do take care of this. Blah, blah, blah. Bullshit. Bullshit. I'm I'm all done. All right. This is a crime against humanity. This is Roger Stone is a political prisoner. I don't. I heard they released him on his own recognizance. I don't know if that's true. But he's still a political prisoner. American thinkers quite right about this. We've got to do something. We got to pressure our, uh, pressure your representatives like never before. Lean on their asses. I'm gonna call mine as soon as I can. I'm artifacts of Mars. I approve this message. Roger Stone, free Roger Stone, political prisoner.